Hi, this is Anna. Welcome back to my channel. Uh, today I'm sharing with you another Halloween uh, patchwork journal. So the cover is made with um, fabric patches and that's all you see around the stitch. So the cover, the journal is eight and a half by 4.75 by about an inch. So here's this uh, kitty cat on the front. It's beautiful fabric. And it ties uh, with this faux leather string with a button. So you just double wrap it and it closes just like that. Here is a button, kind of double-sided. It has pearly side and then uh, the other side. So it's just one signature, but it's a super cool journal for Halloween. And um, I included a lot of ephemera in this one. So the, uh, the cover has this crinkly sound again. And I have front and back pocket made with fabric. I was showing this fabric. This is from Dollar Tree. So this is, um, these are journaling cards or tags. So you could glue these on pages. This would look cool here. And use them in a journal for uh, crafty projects. This is uh, acrylics. So I thought you might use that too. And here is a pocket. <clears throat> Um, with some uh, tickets then this you could also glue this somewhere in a journal and make it into a flip then you have smaller tag and cute sticker so you could make all of these things into a cool this will be a cool tag too. So it's, I think fun project for kids and just really anybody. So more paper, this is double-sided paper. Then this is shiny blue, kind of almost blue. Very pretty color. Then this tag. And those tickets here. And you have this tag and a cool um, sticker. So you can put all of these things together and make projects. This is a tag bookmark with a kitty um, sticker. Or you could glue this here and here and make it into a belly band. Sprayed paper. Here's another pocket. Um, so this is sticker, tag, and another beautiful Halloween paper. Uh, you can cut this into smaller pieces. Then you have some Halloween ephemera in here. Black tag and another ephemera piece. Then here you have more paper so you could glue this and make a flip then this uh, I love these vintage uh, Halloween book pages this is a pocket with couple tags this one has these silver I don't know if you can see kind of it's not like glitter but it's super cool and here I have sticker from Dollar Tree and then sticker on top of that. So I think that's a cool page. Here again is sprayed paper, coffee dyed paper. And here, so you see this Halloween paper here, Wicked Witches Hats. And I don't know if you can see that detail um pumpkin here and ghost very cool paper 
So here I have a larger piece again. You can use it for flips or uh, anything else. And this is called that book page. And this is a sticker, so you can use this also somewhere. It's kind of like coffee dyed paper. And then this is again a sticker uh, from Dollar Tree. And here's another sticker. It's kind of purple pink because I have this color here. Then this is a tuck spot with these uh, pieces of paper. I figured uh, if you wanted to decorate the pages, you could use these. Like for example, you could add this on a side and let's say add a sticker to it. So these are pretty much as long as the pages or you can cut them into smaller pieces and add you know, uh, spaces for for your uh, journaling. And here's one with spiders. So really, you could try that this is double-sided. You could even make it into a tuck spot and put something behind it. So many different options there. So I have them here. I think that's a neat idea. So that's kind of like a belly band. And here, let's see, let's put this here, so here you have the book page, um, so you can read all that stuff, and then this is some cool ephemera, you could make this into a pocket or tuck spot also, and this is my uh, printed with acrylics, with stencils. I thought that's cute. So you can use this and make this into projects. And then on this side, I have this embossed paper, really pretty. And a smaller piece of paper and sticker. Very, very pretty sticker with the haunted house. So you can use all of these things in a journal. This journal is available. If you follow the link, uh, you'll find it. So here, this is from that paper bag that I have here. I cut the uh, bottom. So what you could do is glue this entire thing here. And this will give you a pocket here on the side. Or you could even cut this and then you could use it twice if you wanted to. But anyways, I thought that's cute for like a tuck spot and stuff. And I have two pieces of paper, it's textured, cool thing. And then this is vintage um, yellowed, as you can see, um, glassine envelope. And this is a sticker super cool then ephemera small stickers and small pieces of paper to use um what is it called A sticker again so you could even glue this on three sides at this on the side and this could let's say be your tuck spot and then you have a little tuck spot here so just cute things graveyard on this one guest check or check and then you have another sticker so just a few things to use in this journal and then you can of course glue this envelope in the journal too so I have this all here and this is a tarot card. You can use it as a tuck spot if you glued that or glued, or if you glued this on this side. So whatever you want to do with this. And here's another sticker and a paper clip with a star. 
so there it is all of this for your imagination and then clip it all the way so let's do this one more time it's a lot of stuff here All that stuff that you can use. Okay. And then here's another piece of paper. You could make this into a tuck spot and then put a tag behind it. That would be cute too. So it's a lot of paper. So it's a lot of stuff here. Okay, uh, painted sprayed paper. It's cute, so cute. I love this page here. And the spider webs on the paper. Here we have some extra, so you could glue this down. Here's another ephemera piece. This you could even make into a tuck spot few things here then here's another pocket with more stuff so here's a larger piece this is this feels like leather looks like leather brown color so again for many different projects here's another piece of paper um, music sheet and a tag And then you have vintage Rolodex card, some ephemera, and sticker, this pretty feather. Flip, that's the sprayed paper. And here's another pocket. This is Dollar Tree um, leaf. And then here's a tag you could, what you could do with this is you could even glue this down. You glued this part here and this will give you a flip. And then this one also you can use, you can cut this here and have two different tags. Then last thing is again more paper this is really pretty paper and another tag so you can use all of these things to make this journal your own it's a lot of stuff in it and great project for Halloween I think And then you have this kitty cat. Here's the cover. And it double wraps with the string. And you just tie it for easy closure. And as I mentioned, this, this journal is available at my Etsy shop if you follow the link. As always, thank you so much for watching, liking, sharing, subscribing to my channel. I really appreciate that. And I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.